Welcome friends, I'm Jamin, and I have a lot of issues. I've kind of gotten behind on my GitHub notification tab, and I'd like to start chipping away at that. Not only that, but I asked on Twitter, and all of you jerks told me that I need to do this. Thanks a lot. Anyway, let's get started. We got a lot of issues to work through. So the first issue that caught my eye was with Infinite Red, my company's package API sauce. Now this has suffered a little bit in recent years. We don't really have an internal maintainer. It's been kind of bounced around a little bit. I've done some stuff. We did release 3.0, which was supposed to release with the latest version of Axios, which is an HTTP client for Node and browser is 1.4.0, right? Still 0.27.2. Let's get after this. Let's fix this. Shouldn't take too long. So I clone down API sauce and run yarn. So let's go look at Axios changelog at v1 all the way back to here, 1.0. Okay, added, don't care, changed. Updating the HTTP links. Anyway, it looks like this should be a relatively easy upgrade. And the main thing that we have to bump here is of course Axios itself. So what is the latest? I'm actually gonna go Yarn outdated, yarn upgrade Axios. What that will do is make sure that it upgrades everything up to the latest version of, of Axios. And if I go here, it indeed shows 1.4.0 and yarn test. Something failed. We have a problem here. Um, we expected to get an object and we got null. I'm just gonna grab that, come back to here, command T, paste. So. I am going to copy this into chat GPT. So I'm going to provide it with the change log itself, the tests, which are now failing with this error. Let's grab all this stuff. I'm going to put this into chat GPT and let's give it a shot and see what it says. So we're just going to drop in the whole test to see if we can give it a little more context and see if it can narrow it down for us. What seems to be the most likely? Create server function is indeed returning the expected mock. So what is create server anyway? Here's the server. Again, trying to give it more context so it can help us out. Doesn't seem to have any immediate problems that could cause the test to fail. Uh, the use of localhost in the server listen function. According to your test, you initially set the base URL to localhost and then change it to 127. They could be interpreted differently. Let's just go ahead and console.error response to and see what we get out of it. So connection, uh, connection refused. Copy in this data. See if ChatGPT has any idea about that. It's not listening on, what server are we using? Looks like we're using HTTP. This could be a node issue. Um, we have version 19.9, okay. So what I'm gonna do, stash all this, get stash. So then yarn again, and just verify that it works. Hmm, it's not working. You should always verify your assumptions. That was a little bit of an expensive time-wise lesson. This isn't working. We wanna install 16.20.0. Let's try this again, yarn. And they all pass with 16. That's interesting. That's very interesting. Something changed along the way, 16 versus the latest. Okay, well, lesson learned. So we're gonna figure out which node is not working. All Node.js, let's try that. 18.16, all right. Version is 18.16, we'll rerun yarn. So that one didn't work. Let's see if 17 works. 17 also has this issue. Let's try installing the very first version of 17. And the very first version of 17 also fails. Very interesting. All right, deprecate, um, send for major DNS, runtime deprecate type coercion of DNS lookup options. Let's go back to chat GPT. I know what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna copy all of this stuff in. So, so this error only seems, here's the change log, git stash pop, yarn test. So it's a uh, connection refused is the problem. Let's use good old Google, connection refused, that's too old. Um, ooh. Yeah, this seems like kind of a big deal. Yeah, this is it. This is it. This is the issue. So good old Google gave us this one. 
if I change the local hosts to 0 .0 0.0.0.0, did not fix it for that one. Now, if I just switch this to localhost, does this still fail? That would be weird. This should pass. That did pass. Something about this does not like the 127.0.0.1. I'm going to go back to ChatGBT with node version 17 or above. Here's the code again. I've noticed that you sometimes have to tell it, hey, here's here it is again, because it'll start forgetting stuff if it has a lot of back chat. Uh, this is indeed a peculiar problem. Thank you. It wasn't just me. Especially in IPv6 enabled systems. Could be resolved to colon colon one. I guess we could do this. That's interesting. Look at that. Address was colon colon one IPv6. That is indeed the problem. Okay, well, in fact, let's do ASDF global node.js 16.20.0. Yarn again and yarn test. Yep, that's the problem. That's the difference right there. I'm gonna go back to whatever the latest is. Yarn it, yarn test, just to make sure. Using the DNS snippet, I can see indeed that node IPv6. How can I force the server to use IPv4? Just two colons. I wonder if that will work with for old node. Yeah, it's saying, just two colons and it passes node.js 16.20.0 yarn yarn test and it passes as well okay i think we fixed our problem ironically this one line of code that's it one line of code to fix that whole problem one last test okay fixes 307 axios was not fully upgraded also fixed an issue version 17 plus as the create server HTTP function uses IPv6 and didn't recognize as previous nodes did. This is kind of important, critical, creating a pull request here. Um, checks have failed. What, what version of node do we have here? It's always stuff like this. Uh, 10, okay, all right, all right, all right. Um, bumped circle CI 19.9. Push that up and let's see what happens. All right, so we need a, a code review. Really not all that much to show for the sheer amount of time that I spent on this. I'm gonna ask eeny, meeny, miny, mo, Robin. I'm gonna ask Robin to review this and then we'll come back to it. So one down, 200 and I don't know, 29 to go. At least you got a chance to see what it looks like to solve a bug like this. And I got a little bit further into my inbox. Tune in next time. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and hit the like button. Anyway, we'll see you all next time. Thanks a lot, friends.